Welcome to Cam Look, coming to you from the Cincinnati Art Museum, where every day at 10 a.m. we share an object from the permanent collection and bring questions for discussion. I'm Julie, a Cam docent. I've often wondered, if the objects in the galleries could talk, what would they tell me about their lives before arriving at the Cincinnati Art Museum? Today, let's listen to a few of their stories in what I'll call the Artwork Diaries. First owned by American steamboat inventor Robert Fulton, I am a large work measuring nine feet by 12 feet. I was painted in 1792 by Benjamin West, an American who lived and worked in London. After Fulton's death, I was purchased by Nicholas Longworth. I was the first work by a major artist to come to Cincinnati, having been rolled up and put on a flatboat to travel down the Ohio River. I adorned the ballroom at Belmont, Longworth's home, which is now the Taft Museum of Art. Eventually, I was passed on to Joseph Longworth, who gifted me to the brand new Cincinnati Art Museum. I was on display when the cam opened in 1886. I'm titled Hamlet, Act 4, Scene 5, or sometimes Ophelia and Laertes. Imagine the generations of inquisitive school children who have learned about Hamlet from me. What things have changed in my long history at the cam? And what stays the same? As a work of art, I escaped tragedy, but not without humiliation. Painted by Austrian artist Oskar Kokoschka in 1910, I was the first of his works to enter a museum. But I was seized by the Nazis, along with thousands of other works of art from public institutions in Germany. In their eyes, we were degenerate art that would, quote, insult German sentiment or destroy or confuse natural form. I was used as propaganda to be ridiculed and scorned as one of about 650 works displayed in the 1937 Degenerate Art Exhibition in Munich. Over two million people in four months lined up to see us. Here I am in this 1942 inventory prepared by the Reich Ministry for Public Enlightenment and Propaganda of 16,000 confiscated works of art. This is just one page out of 482 typewritten pages comprising two volumes. After the Degenerate Art Show, I was one of 125 works chosen to be auctioned in Switzerland to raise some foreign cash. Through a buyer at the auction, I was purchased by Cincinnatian Paul E. Geyer, who bequeathed me to the Cincinnati Art Museum. Many of my cohorts were not so lucky. The ones with the X were destroyed, like these man rays. I am titled the Duchess of Montesquieu Fiesensack. You can check out my detailed provenance on the CAM website. Despite being held up for derision, do you think I may have opened some minds? When you think about it, every one of the 67,000 objects in our collection was created with intent by human hands and minds, and every one of them has a story. Next time you visit the museum, what painting or sculpture would you like to have a conversation with? What questions would you ask? And what might the artwork ask of you?